What a ball game it was here tonight at Kennedy Catholic High School. Kennedy Catholic comes away rallying for a three-point victory, 75-72 over the Irish from Akron, St. Vincent, St. Mary. Hi again, everybody. Chad Krispinski back with you. It's time to visit with our victorious head coach, Rick Mancino. Our Game of the Week coaches interview is sponsored by the Curbstone Coaches. And coach, you have coached in some huge games through the course of especially the most recent few years and through your long career. What does this victory mean tonight against a great St. Vincent, St. Mary team? Well, you know, we're never going to overlook the state championships, but... The actual games uh, tonight against this team, who I think is probably one of the best teams in the Midwest, maybe Eastern part of the state or country. Uh, great coach, and uh, that was huge. Uh, we were down 11 points. We came out, you know, we were talking to our team, and we said one possession at a time. And our players, they just came through, man. Uh, our best players showed up big time. Oscar and Maceo, <laughs> what can you say? They have been such stalwarts all season long through their time in a Golden Eagle uniform. What do they mean to this program? What do they mean to this win here tonight? Well, uh, no school could ever ask for two great kids like that. I mean, outside of basketball. But I've, I've been saying this, and I hope I don't jinx them. I think we are the best one-two punch in the country. I mean, you saw Oscar as a McDonald's All-American. Maceo could have very easily been that. Uh, but, you know, I said before the game, for us to be successful, your big players got to show up. But we also had other players. I thought Ike Herser came in and hit that big three. Skyler, sophomore, came out and hit that three-pointer. Uh, Matia, who's just coming back into it, everyone's going to look at mistakes and things like that, but Matia did great. You know, he, his passing, uh, once we get into a flow, once we get together, I think our team could be very good. Coach, back-to-back-to-back -to -back -to -back state championships. It certainly doesn't get old. How have you kept your team so business-like and humble through all of this, through all the publicity and all the accolades that they receive? They come out here, they play hard, and they execute. What's the secret? Well, to have players like Macy and Oscar it definitely <laughs> helps. But, no, you know what? That's why we played the schedule. Our, you know, we, I talk to my players. I'm not one of those coaches that try to dictate everything. I talk to our players, you know, going into this year, and I said, what do you, what do you think? And uh, they go, we want to play the best players, best teams. And that's why we played Brush last week. That's why we played the Knights game, you know? And that's how we're keeping them motivated because, you know, we're playing in 6A this year, and we know there's a lot of good teams, a lot of good teams in our league, let alone, you know, in the, uh, the state playoffs. But that's the motivation. I think our guys want to get better. They want to be successful. They have that, that inner drive. And, uh, and, and we have great leaders. You know, when you have someone like Macy telling you, you better bust your butt, or if you have someone like Oscar who's, who's you know, he could very easily just go on to West Virginia, and, you know, but he, you see how hard he plays. And uh, so when you have your best players playing super hard, the other guy's got to play. And you know what? And I think Matia's getting there. Ike picks it up. Our other guys are getting there. Once we get Bowler back, uh, you know, we're, I think things could uh, pretty, good, pretty good. Well, Coach, we're so thrilled we were able to <laughs> be here for this one tonight yeah. to see an absolute well, thriller. I think, uh, I mean, it was fun. I thought this was the loudest our gym's been. Uh, it reminded me of some of the feral games that we played here. And, and uh, But this team here, uh, no disrespect towards any team that we ever played, but this is probably the best team that came to our gym. And uh, they're, they're loaded, and a lot of respect for them and their program. That's why they have all those state championships. And uh, we appreciate you guys coming here. Coach, great night. congratulations on Thank a great victory. Much. Thank That's you. That's victorious head coach Rick Mancino, Kennedy Catholic, coming away with a 75-72 victory over the Irish from Akron, St. Vincent, St. Mary.